Every day, millions of hearts beat relentlessly, but sometimes they need a little help to keep the rhythm. Imagine the heart as a tireless pump, pushing life through our veins, but like any pump, it can falter, stumble, even break down. Heart diseases sneak in, disrupting this vital symphony. When our heart cries out for aid, medical intervention becomes our ally, stepping in to mend what's broken, to restore the rhythm. And when the heart needs help, two superheroes come to the rescue, angioplasty and bypass surgery. Imagine a city's water supply system. The heart is the water tower, arteries are the pipes. When a pipe gets blocked, the water flow decreases. That's when angioplasty steps in. Just as a plumber would clear a clogged pipe, an angioplasty does the same for your arteries. A tiny balloon is threaded through your blood vessels to the blockage. Once there, it's inflated to push the plaque aside and restore blood flow. Just like that, the water, or rather, the blood, is flowing freely again. And here's the best part. Angioplasty is less invasive compared to other procedures. It's like fixing a pipe blockage without tearing down the whole building. Recovery time is quicker too. You're back on your feet in no time, almost like a minor hiccup in the city's water supply. Typically, angioplasty is the go-to for blockages in one or two arteries. Think of it as fixing a couple of faulty pipes in the city. With angioplasty, the city's water supply, or rather the heart's blood flow, is restored. But what if there are multiple blockages? Here's where our second hero, bypass surgery, steps in. Imagine a traffic jam on a main road. You can't clear it quickly. What do you do? You take a detour. Bypass surgery operates on a similar principle. It's a heart operation that creates a new pathway, or bypass, around a section of a blocked or partially blocked artery. However, unlike our first hero, angioplasty, bypass surgery is a more invasive procedure, akin to constructing a new road rather than just clearing a blockage. This means it requires a longer recovery time. Think of it as waiting for the new road's asphalt to set. But here's the kicker. It's often chosen when there are multiple blockages, like multiple traffic snarls on different roads. In essence, bypass surgery is a methodical, well-planned detour that ensures the blood, our life's traffic, keeps moving even when the main road is blocked. So, bypass surgery, like a well-planned detour, ensures the blood, or traffic, keeps moving. So, who's the winner in this heart battlefield? Well, it's not that simple. The key differences make each procedure unique. Angioplasty, quick and less invasive, shines in mild to moderate blockages, while bypass surgery, though more complex, is a true lifesaver in severe heart disease. But remember, it's not a one-size-fits-all. Your health, your heart's condition, they take the steering wheel in this decision. Remember, both angioplasty and bypass surgery are superheroes in their own right. They fight the same battle to keep the heart, the city's water tower, the traffic controller beating strong.